game on Christmas Day against a winless team, so you cannot take anger for granted. As you take a look at the quarters, we talked about that a little bit. Uh, this was uh, the steal by uh, Delo. Delo, you know, no? Yeah, first, Delo, quarter. One, first quarter. And one deflection, which also resulted in their conversion. And the first quarter, um, I think officially it ended at uh, 23 apiece, you know? Uh, and then the second quarter, 47-46 uh, of the table black water. But it's the main passing in the game. 48-47. It's in favor of black water. But the third quarter, a good start here oh, yeah. by black water. It's a good start here by black water. It's a good start here by black water. Ito yung natawagan ng second flagrant foul penalty once si Ringel Tandy Pringle as he tried to fight the pitch and tried to close out but he was on a different angle at three. He got into the landing spot of uh, Mark Bello. And the uh, final push uh, yeah, in three point shot. Yeah. Uh, the red yung uh, malaking lead ng Blackwater. One last final push came from Global Court uh, with Pesumal knocking down some big ones. And then Kanye later, but not enough in the end. Yeah, we were referring as you take a look at the uh, field goal percentage, Major Masmuta on Blackwater. Had more free throws, plus eight Silajan. Had less rebounds, minus eight. But, uh, you know, I, I think overall because they had more field goal attempts and they had better percentage from the field, that's the reason why they won this ball game. You would say handily in the end game. Let's take a look at the uh, leading uh, producers uh, for this game. Well, we already know the Blackwater side, no art. And then, but uh, Ronji also played very well. Terence Romeo, 22. Stanley Pringle, 14. He didn't play the whole of the fourth and half of the third. JR Kinyahan tapered off with 12. And Nino Canaleta, some blossom here at the end with 11. And of course, Pesumal, I think, at 9.